Hey everyone and welcome to the Saturday Morning Sew Along. So today we're going to be making one of these fabulous ponchos. They're super quick and super easy and I'm going to show you how to do it today. Okay, so take two rectangles. Um, ideally, you want them to be 60 inches wide by 30 inches deep. Lay them out together so that their right sides are facing and matching up the raw edges. On the top edge, measure in 15 inches and put a pin or a clip. I might actually use clips on this one. So measure 15 inches in and put a clip. And again on this edge, measure 15 inches in and put a clip. We're going to sew straight across here. We're not sewing here, sewing down the sides, across the bottom, but we need to leave a gap for opening. So I'm going to put two more clips at the bottom and that's my opening for turning inside out. So I'll make the stitches. So I just have a really quick request. If you're enjoying this video and if you'd like to see more content like this, if you'd like me to make more um, sewing videos, then please give me a like and please, please subscribe to my channel. Okay, so it's all stitched in place all around the outer edge. So I've left at the top this little gap here, which is 15 inches and this gap, which is 15 inches and a small gap at the bottom for turning. So next, we're going to just mark the halfway mark. So fold it in half, and you just want to do a little clip in that seam to show your halfway mark. A little notch to show me the halfway mark, and the same in the bottom, which will be open because if you see, just do a little snip in there. Okay. Okay, so next, with all the people, we've got an opening here and we've got an opening here. And I'm just going to cut a little notch in the seam, no further than your stitches, just a little snip like that, just there. And the same on this side, just snip a little notch, just down to your stitches, there and there. So the next thing to do is we have to tuck this edge inside to this edge so we're going to to do that I'm going to reach in through my opening take hold of this corner and pull it all the way across all the way across so that it comes out this corner and once you have the two edges there we are just pull it so it's flat like that and what you have is it's inside itself, so you can see there, everything's gone inside. And if I shake it down, that's inside. So this piece that was out here has gone inside of itself and the two openings are together next to each other here. And we should be able to put our fingers in and just pull that out like that. So that's there. So what I want to do now is just make sure everything's lining up nicely and I'm going to stitch. So because we've cut those little, little vents, I, it will now open out and I can stitch. So the seam allowance, your right side should be together. Turn this seam allowance inwards and leave that one outwards for now. Lay it all up and we're going to stitch along there and stop at the original stitching that we did. So going through all four layers. So we're stitching completely the way across. And that's now stitched. You can see my stitches along there. So that's all four layers there stitched together like that. Okay, and next, reach in here and pull it all the right way out. So reaching in, pulling everything to the right side. Shake it all out. And what you'll find is that you have your poncho is finished. So all that's left to do is just to reach in and pull the corners out. 
I told you this was an easy one. <laughs> so reach in. Now I want mine to be the other way around, so just turn it to the right side. So this is where your, your head goes, so out there. Just need to tidy up the corners. So before we seal up the hole, reach in, just make sure all the corners are pushed out. So push out the corners and push out the corners. If you've got thick fabric, you can snip the corners at an angle just to get rid of any excess and then they will push out nicely like that. There we are. Now along this edge, we just need to close up this. So I'm just going to fold it in like that and stitch along that bottom edge to close. There we are, so stitch along that bottom edge to close. So once you have your project finished, um, pressed, it's ready to wear. I'm just putting a button on the, on the shoulder um, of mine. I found one that sort of goes quite well with the lining. So I'm just going to stitch this in place. And there we are, the poncho is finished. I really like it, um, I'm really pleased with the colours. Obviously make it in whichever colours, whatever fabrics you would like. Thank you so much for watching again today. I hope you enjoy the video and I hope you'll join me again next week for another Saturday Sew Along. So I just have a really quick request. If you're enjoying this video and if you'd like to see more content like this, if you'd like me to make more um, sewing videos, then please give me a like and please, please subscribe to my channel.